this video tutorial i will cover at post construct annotation and at pre destroy annotation here i have defined the class employee it has two properties id and name and getter and setter methods for these two properties here i have defined the method init and applied at post construct annotation so this method will be called by the spring container after id and name properties of employee bean is set here i have defined the method cleanup and applied at pre destroy annotation so this method will be called by the spring container after employee bean is released from the spring container here i have overridden two string method at post construct annotation is alternative to initializing bean interface and init method attribute at pre destroy annotation is alternative to disposable bean interface and destroy method attribute at post construct and at pre destroy annotations are not belongs to spring it is located in j2e library called common annotation.jar to make at post construct and at pre destroy annotation to work we have to either register common annotation bean post processor or specify annotation config in the spring configuration file here i have defined the class app here i have created configurable application context object by reading a spring configuration file using get bean method of configurable application context object getting employee object from spring container and displaying the employee object then i am calling close method of configurable application context object once the close method is called all the resources will be released and it will destroy all hashed singleton beans once we run this program we will get uh, this output here you can see init method is called after uh, employee bean is uh, initialized meaning id and name properties of uh, employee bean is set here you can see cleanup method is called after uh, close method of uh, configurable application context object is uh, called 